But today's loss is related with the stab in our back by the associates of terrorism. That has been given to us in our back by the accomplices of terrorists. I cannot uh, find another wording to what happened today. Our uh, plane was shot down over the, Syria, over the Syrian territory. The air-to-air -air missile came from F-16 Turkish uh, warplane. It fell on the territory of Syria, four kilometers away from the Turkish border. It was at an altitude of 6,000 uh, meters, so one kilometer away from the Turkish border when it was hit. In any case, our pilots and our plane never threatened the Republic of Turkey in any way. We have long identified that there are a lot of oil and petro products going to Turkey from the captured territories. And certainly these uh, military groups get their financing from. And now they stab us in the back, they hit our planes that are fighting terrorism. And together with the U.S. partners, we signed an agreement on uh, to prevent uh, incidents in the air. And Turkey also announced that they are allegedly are fighting terrorism as part of the U.S. dead coalition. If ISIS have this uh, amount of money, and it could be even billions of dollars due to the sale, uh, sales of oil, and plus they have protection from the armed forces of a big state, then now it's clear why they are so impertinent, why they, why they kill people in the most barbarous, heinous ways. Why they conduct terrorist acts uh, across many countries, including in the heart of Europe. Certainly, we will analyze what happened very seriously. And today's tragic event will have uh, serious consequences for Russian Turkish relations. We have always uh, treated Turkey not just a close neighbor, but to a friendly state. And instead of immediately establishing the necessary contact with us, as far as I'm aware of, the Turkish side contacted its NATO allies. to discuss uh, this incident, as if we downed a Turkish jet. Do they want NATO to serve the interests of ISIS?